Hello everyone, this is your Lekala Master Ruhar Gopal. In this video, I am going to discuss one interesting problem from NTSC stage 1 paper from Andhra region which was held in the this year only 2021. Very interestingly, you can understand the problem as well as the solution. This problem will definitely help you to understand the standard of NTSC problems in the question paper. So without wasting time, let me introduce the question NTSC 2021 Andhra region question. If x by 2x plus y plus z if you observe carefully numerator x in the denominator 2x is there so x by 2x plus y plus z is equal to y by x plus 2y plus z if you observe here y is there here 2y is there is equal to z by x plus y plus 2z is equal to a so observe carefully x by 2x plus y plus z equal to y by x plus 2y plus z equal to z by x plus y plus 2z equal to a where x plus y plus z is not equal to 0 then what is the value of a four numerical values were given you are supposed to find out the numerical value of a by using all these three relations whatever given you are supposed to keep in your mind x plus y plus z is not equal to 0. So let me keep the question here. So whatever the four quantities were given x by 2x plus y plus z, y by x plus 2y plus z, z by x plus y plus 2z and a whatever the four quantities were given. First I am taking the first two quantities here x by 2x plus y plus z equal to y by x plus 2y plus z. So as we can see the two fractions on the either side of equal to symbol simply we go for the cross multiplication what you are going to get x of x plus 2y plus z equal to y of 2x plus y plus z if you remove the brackets you are going to get two different expressions here in which 2xy is a common term simply if you cancel 2xy and transpose all the terms to that side so you are going to get x square minus y square plus xz minus yz so from first two terms if you observe carefully it is in the form of a square minus b square which is a very simple algebraic identity which can be written as a minus b into a plus b so that only i am replacing x square minus y square can be replaced with x minus y of x plus y similarly xz minus yz whatever is there simply if you take z common you are going to get x minus y as a factor so observe carefully in both the things we can see x minus y common so if you take x minus y what you are going to get x minus y of x plus y plus z is equal to 0 when the product of two quantities is equal to 0 we know that any one of those two quantities must be equal to 0 but in the question it was given x plus y plus z is not equal to 0 which means that definitely x minus y should be equal to 0 that only I am mentioning here as x plus y plus z is not equal to 0 x minus y should be equal to 0 if x minus y equal to 0 definitely x equal to y so by taking the first two expressions we got x equal to y similarly if you take second and third which is nothing but y by x plus 2y plus z equal to z by x plus y plus 2z if you take and if you do the same calculation you are going to get y equal to z so here we got x equal to y here y equal to z on the whole we can understand x equal to y equal to z by using all the first three relations here it was given in the question a equal to any one of these three fractions so a equal to x by 2x plus y plus z we are supposed to find out the numerical value of a simply we replace y and z with x what you are going to get a equal to x by 2x plus x plus x which is nothing but a equal to x by 4x if you cancel x you are going to get a equal to 1 by 4 so the numerical value of a is going to be 1 by 4 so my dear children if you have a look at this entire solution you, you need not to know any much concepts of mathematics simple algebraic identity and algebraic simplification is more than enough to solve this problem hope you understand this particular problem so that you can understand the standard of NTSC questions in the further exams so my dear children we will meet in the next video with another interesting problem from the NTSC papers only until then take care bye bye you are Lekala Mastaru Haragopal